people are traveling home to be with loved ones this holiday season, but countless refugees from Syria are trying to make a new home in a new country. And one New York City woman is using her hobby to help them stay warm this winter as they begin their new lives. TV 1055's Marley Hall has a story. Anna Strasser learned to knit when she was 14 and often makes presents for family and friends. But this holiday season, the aspiring theater director used her knitting needles to help strangers in need. Being able to do something, even if it was just a little thing, was important to me. She read about a group of Syrian immigrants in Munich who needed hats and scarves to face the harshest winter of their lives. Hundreds of thousands of refugees made it to Germany this year. I clicked on the blog post and read the rules and basically picked up my needles and started going. In six weeks, Anna knitted 11 brightly colored hats and a scarf. I give away most of the things I knit anyway, so it felt like a pretty natural thing for me to do. Anna and other knitters in the U.S. and Canada made almost a thousand hats, scarves, and other knitwear that were shipped to Germany. The project began two months ago when knitting designer Laura Nelkin put out the call to her fellow hobbyists. A doctor in Munich coordinated the distribution to refugees, and photos of the giveaway soon went viral on knitting websites. One of them caught Anna's eye. I was like, oh my God, that boy has my hat. <laughs> and so it was a totally amazing moment. We're on Christmas break now. <laughs> With help from her friends, Anna is knitting more hats for those who need it most. And while much of the world continues to debate the politics of the refugee crisis, these busy hands are working to spread a little warmth. And the U.S. based project is drawing to a close now since European knitters are now involved in coordinating closer to home. Now back to that.